when we think of a personal computer or micro computer we tend to think of the equipment itself that is the monitor or keyboard we need to understand that there is more to a micro computer than that it is a part of a bigger unit called an information system a complete information system is made up of five parts hardware software data users and procedures let us understand each part consist of all devices of the computer that you can see and touch these include input processing and output devices the software of a computer system refers to the organized sets of instructions that control the working of the computer's operations these instructions are stored as programs some programs are used by the computer to control its own tasks and devices data consists of raw facts and figures which the computer manipulates and processes into meaningful information data is stored in digital form on the computer this means that the computer reads and stores all data as numbers however it outputs information in a form that can be understood by human beings in a payroll system the data would be the number of hours worked and the pay rate this is processed or multiplied to yield information which would be the weekly pay four common types of data files are document files created by word processors such as memos and letters worksheet files created by electronic spreadsheets to analyze things like budgets and predict sales database files created by database management programs which contain organized data for example an employee database file might contain all the workers names job titles social security numbers and other related information presentation files created by presentation graphics programs to save presentation materials for example a file might contain audience handouts speaker notes and electronic slides a user is a person who uses the computer with a specific objective the computer makes him more productive user is not involved with the internal functioning of the computer system user inputs data and gets the information user requires because user uses the computer externally we often overlook a user as a part of an information system a procedure is an ordered set of tasks for performing some action the rules or guidelines that are followed in the use of hardware software and data are procedures software and hardware manufacturers provide manuals containing guidelines for use of their products in printed or electronic form